Hi guys, so yesterday HPool launched their new cheer pool for plots created using the official cheer pooling protocol. In this video I'm going to explain how to set it up and how to form your NFT plots alongside your OG plots with HPool. HPool say that they're going to be releasing two different pools using the pooling protocol. This, the first to be released, uses HPool's own mining app which was released to GitHub yesterday. Called HPool Cheer Miner PP, it's basically identical to the existing HPool Miner, which has now been renamed to HPool Cheer Miner OG. The second pool they intend to release will use the official Cheer blockchain software, just like the other existing official Cheer pools. HPool also announced that they're going to be airdropping 30 Cheer each day to be divided among miners using the new pool from the 16th to the 21st of July as an incentive. Just like the OG HPool Miner, this new software does require you to generate a signature using your private keywords. So if you don't feel comfortable with that, it's probably best to stay with official pools. To get started, first you need to go to the HPool website, which is now being moved to ihpool.com and open the download center. Then click on Sheer PP Miner at the bottom to bring you to the GitHub page. Scroll down until you see Assets and look for the relevant version of the app for your system. There are versions for Linux, Windows and macOS. Since I'm using a Mac, I'm downloading the macOS version. Once it's downloaded, you can move the app into your Applications folder. But before you do that, you'll need to rename the old Cheer app, otherwise the new one will just overwrite it. And you need to run both simultaneously if you want to pull NFT plots and OG plots at the same time. So I just added hyphen old on the end of the existing HPool app before I dragged the new app in there. When you run the new app you'll see your old OG plot folders listed there from the original app since they share the same config file. But the capacity will be zero on all of them and they won't count towards your space. Now we need to go back to the HPool website and open the Cheer PP pool. Click on open pool on the left and then click all. Now scroll down to Cheer PP and click on Open Pool. You'll see the mining pool was successfully opened at the top of the screen. And if you go back to Open Pool, you'll see that you now have both Cheer OG and Cheer PP listed there. Now you need to go into the official Cheer app and either add a new plot NFT to begin creating plots for HPool or change from your current pool to HPool. If you're changing from another pool, remember that you will lose any earnings you've accumulated that haven't already been paid out. Click on Change Pool, then delete the existing pool name and replace it with https colon forward slash forward slash cheerpp.hpool.com. You'll see the pool details appear below. Once you've confirmed that the details are correct, click on Change and the process of changing pools will start. It will take a few minutes but the status will change from pooling to pending and then eventually back to pooling again with the new pool address. Now you need to go back to the download center on the HPool website and click on the link for Chia Plotter. This is what you'll use to generate the signature from your private keys. Again scroll down to assets, click on the little arrow to expand the list and choose the version for your system. Now on the HPool website, click Open Pool, then under Cheer PP, click on Go to Configuration. You'll see boxes there for Bind Signature Data and Bind Login Link. In your Downloads folder, open the Cheer Plotter folder and then run Cheer Plotter Darwin AMD64. A command prompt window will open and you'll be asked for your mnemonic words. Again, this is the part that many people have an issue with. So if you don't feel comfortable doing this, it's best to stick with the official pools. On the login screen of the official Cheer app, click on the little eye icon next to your private key to bring up your private keys and seed phrase. Highlight the seed words at the bottom and then copy them with Command and C. Then switch back to Terminal and press Command and V to paste them. Once you've pasted the words, press Enter and you'll see your fingerprint, public keys and signature. Highlight the long hexadecimal string after signature and press Command and C to copy it. Then on the HPool website, click in the Bind Signature Data box and press Command and V to paste the text you just copied. Then back in the official Cheer app again, click on the three little dots to the right of your NFT name and select View Pool Login Link. A window will appear with your login link and you can click on the clipboard icon to copy it to the clipboard. Then go back to the HPool website again 
click in the box for bind login link and then press command and V to paste the address into the box. Finally click on bind and you should see plotter bind successfully at the top of the screen. Next click on the clipboard icon next to API key to copy it to the clipboard. Then in the HPool Cheer Minor PP app, click on setting and in the window that pops up delete the API key that's there, paste the API key that you just copied and click on the button at the bottom with Chinese characters in it. Then you can click add and start adding the folders with your NFT plots in them. You'll see in the official Cheer app that your pool difficulty goes up to 100 billion. So effectively you have no chance of ever hitting a block in the official app, all of the farming rewards will come through HPool. I found that because both the old and new HPool apps share the same config.yaml, there's no way to have only the NFT plots in the new app and the OG plots in the old app. Instead you have to add all of your plot folders containing both OG and NFT plots and they'll appear in both apps. But only the OG plots count towards your space in the OG app and only the NFT plots count towards your space in the PP app. You'll find that it takes a while before your plots show up under Cheer PP and you begin seeing earnings. For me it was about 12 hours. But there's nothing to worry about, the answer is just to be patient and wait. Eventually you will see the plots appear and earnings will start. Under Open Pool you'll have both Cheer OG and Cheer PP listed, each with their own earnings. And under Online Miner you'll be able to switch between HPool OG and HPool PP in the drop down menu. If you look in Revenue, then select Cheer PP in the drop down, you'll see the regular cheer earned from blocks found by the pool listed under Block Income. And Cheer from the Airdrop is listed under Mortgage Income. At the moment, the Airdrop earnings are quite a lot more than the actual block earnings because the pool is still relatively small. But as the pool grows, those earnings will gradually reduce and end on the 21st. I hope this video helps as the process is a little bit complicated. But if you have any questions, put them down in the comments below and I'll do my best to answer them. That's it for this video, thanks for watching.